Earlier this week, Nikki told you all about the Ford F-150 Lightning, and that's a really nice truck. Like, to be totally honest, I think it's a great truck, but I'm not really a truck guy, so I wasn't excited about it. But this, this I'll admit I'm excited about. And that's because this may be a classic car on the outside, but underneath, this is a cutting edge performance EV. This is Ford's Illuminator. It's the vehicle they're using to showcase their new Illuminator crate motor, which is an electric motor based on the motor out of the Mach-E, which can is designed to be dropped into all sorts of other vehicles, from classic conversions to maybe not so classic conversions. We have seen footage of this thing out on a track. It is remarkable and to be honest, that's not what I love about it. What I love about it is that this whole project, the Illuminator project, as they highlighted with this car, gives hope for keeping classic cars on the road. I owned classic cars for many years. I loved them. And the thing that was always hard for me was that they spew out huge quantities of pollutants, far more than what you'd get out of even a modern internal combustion car. My uh, Pontiac, I had a 1950 Pontiac, and you couldn't be in the garage with it for more than a moment with it running before you felt like you were suffocating. And just thinking about what that was doing to the environment was one of the reasons we got rid of it. But this, man, if I'd had one of these motors, I'd still have that Pontiac. This truck represents really the very beginning of what I'm hoping will be a whole new era of custom cars and revitalized classics. Now, we can't get into this one because it's locked, but looking through the windows, it's basically a Maki on the inside as well with a Maki instrument panel and controller and that's a little bit of a letdown for me. I totally get why Ford would go that route, but I want something that feels like the original, and I know there are gonna be people who agree with me and who are gonna go that route. And it's also nice to know that if you want to do something a little more contemporary with the inside of your electrified classic, that's something you can do. So if the F100 Custom Illuminator is the showcase this, is what it's showcasing. This is a new Illuminator crate motor from Ford. The idea is you get your motor, you get your drive shaft, you get everything you need, and you can drop it into whatever you are planning to electrify. It's really cool. And I, one of the things that stands out to me as a car guy is that it's not very big. I mean, I couldn't put it in my suitcase, but when you think about like a crate V8, this feels downright small, and that's super exciting. It gives so much flexibility. Of course, you are gonna have to figure out where to put your batteries, so it makes sense. But I think this is just the beginning of a really exciting future for electrifying classic vehicles. So because this truck is locked, I can't show you under the hood, but if I did, you'd be looking pretty much at the motor I showed you earlier. It is worth noting this truck has independent rear suspension and the battery pack is slung underneath just like you would expect in any modern EV. Now, I will say I took a look underneath and it is wild to look under a classic car and see what looks like a modern electric vehicle. It is such a beautiful packaging of classic, elegant, traditional Ford engineering with the absolute most cutting edge of what the electric vehicle world has to offer. That's it for today. If you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to leave your thoughts below or in our free to join Discord chat room. There's a link in the video description. If you haven't already, make sure you subscribe to this channel and our other channel, Transfer Evolve Take Two, and give the bell a ring to make sure you're told when our next video goes live. Thanks on behalf of the entire T-Crew, go out to the folk on my right for being our $15 to $49 a month supporters. Special thanks to our $50 a month supporters, Chris Maxwell, Bennett Elder, Brian Newton, Jason Boder, Dave Kitchen, Michael Goad, Ricky Leung, Andrew Martin, Guido Drahada, 
Brophy Wolf, Tezlin Legong, Gordon C., Stephen O'Donoghue, Kyle Hodson, Anthony Coates, Raging Fellows, Rory Litwin, Anonymous Freak, Jim Burness, and Denny Hyde. And our deepest gratitude to our 100 All Month supporters Marcel Ward, Reggie Watts, Joe Bresney, JP Figureback, Will Graylin, Matthew Drobnak, John Lyons, Christopher Lee Jones, Laura Reynolds, Paul Conway, Ellery Hensley, and Ian. Feeling left out? You can join Patreon at the link below, click the join button on YouTube, become a channel supporter, or show us your support through Bitcoin, Kofi, or a cool swag store. There are more links to that below. Thanks for joining me, and as always, keep evolving!